the studio. Oh, we're warming up and we are staying nice and warm. We can call this above seasonal now, Kevin. Look at this, 19 degrees for the city of Toronto. A few showers up to the north. We saw that through Timmins as well this morning. Just a few bands of moisture in the atmosphere. This is what the next seven days looks like. This is the city of Toronto here. Beautiful conditions. Maybe you're running the Toronto Marathon, the Mississauga Marathon. I'm running that one. You know what? Sunday looks amazing. It is the most perfect running weather, and I'm sure everybody, every runner, is certainly looking forward to that. This is a little wider shot here. This is Thursday afternoon. Temperatures slightly cooler into tomorrow. We will see some more cloud cover. And in terms of the showers, too, we are going to see a few bands of moisture again in the atmosphere through Thursday, especially throughout southern Ontario. Hit and miss showers here. So a little tough to forecast, but again, Pack the umbrella, you'll probably need it. In the greater Toronto area, looks like your chance is a little less in terms of seeing that rain. Now let's talk about the heat. Yesterday, Alberta was way above seasonal, 28 degrees in Calgary. Today, you can see where that chunk of warm air is. It's now into Saskatchewan, 26 degrees is the daytime high in Regina. So we're really feeling some of that warmth here. As we take a look out, you can see some cooler temperatures move through the overnight, but then look at that into Thursday, that warm chunk of air now off into Manitoba. Where we're not seeing the warm air, that's out on the Atlantic coast. We're going to get into that in a second, but we'll talk about some of this rain here along the BC coast because we are going to start to see the rain a little heavier at times throughout the afternoon and the overnight. This is a widespread look at how much here. You can see the central and northern coast, you could get close to 90 millimeters of rain. The south coast, more of those on and off showers for you, but especially through the overnight. We'll jump now to the opposite side of the country and it really is the complete opposite sort of weather too. Charlottetown breaking records in terms of the snow. The mix See that pink that pops up near Charlottetown? Still getting into the mixing today. Below seasonal temperatures, and this rain will continue to move through today, especially for Newfoundland. But the good news is, Maritimes, you'll see showers tomorrow, but they will be a lot weaker. Yeah, doing some spring cleaning, painting the home. You want dry weather and you want some pretty comfortable temperatures. So if you're in Calgary, hey, that looks like a pretty good forecast there. Do some painting in Winnipeg as well. 24 degrees, the city of Toronto, 15. This is a look into Thursday. You don't want to be painting out in the Atlantic because unfortunately we're still getting into some of that wet weather. Friday as well finally starts to clear out. But look at Winnipeg's temperatures, staying very comfortable at 22. Out on the West Coast, Friday looking like a drier day.